What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, the Uncrowned Otaku. Latest episode of Jujutsu Kaisen came out, and latest two episodes, actually, because we're going to go back in episode. We're going to talk about my boy, Megumi. He was putting in that work, but he did that domain expansion. He, he realized a potential future self that was higher than his current self. And even though the, the vision was incomplete, he did that domain chimera formation. He was, he was, wow, shadow frogs crawling up his leg. Ah, you got me. Surprise, it was a shadow all along. Shadow clone jutsu. That was his version of a shadow clone jutsu. All in the domain. And the significance there is the domain itself. Not the fact that it was incomplete, but the fact that he could do one means he's well on his way to being a special grade type sorcerer. Because even people as legit and as deadly as Nanami, he's a first grade, but he can't do a domain. He admitted, like, that's the extent of his power. Uh, my TV. He admitted that's the extent of his power. And that's where he plateaued. Like, he can't go any higher. He can't do a domain. So, with Megumi doing one, it kind of shows, like, where he could go. How far his powers can take him, honestly. But that was, that was last week's episode. Let's get to this week's. We had... What's his name? I keep forgetting people's name. Nobara. That's my homegirl's name, Nobara. Nobara and Yuji were fighting two maybe curses. Turns out they were actually humans the whole time. And... I don't think Nobara didn't realize it until she slayed the younger brother and it didn't disappear. And then she was like, wait, it didn't disappear. Is it not a curse? And then Yuji was like, oh man, here we go. And what it hit my soul a little bit when, when Big Bro started crying, he was like, I couldn't protect my brother. And he started shedding tears. I was like, oh man, why does he gotta be evil? And even Yuji was like, hey man, I'm sorry about this. Black Flash still destroyed him. And then the dude is so savage. A car was passing by. He hopped on the car, took a dude hostage. Like, ask, don't you stop driving. You hit the brakes and you're dead to me. You hear me? You're dead. Don't hit the brakes. Yuji, just off the, off the brute strip, Yuji ran as fast as a car that's gunning it. At least, that thing was at least going 80, maybe even 100. And Yuji was just huffing and puffing it. And we could tell how fast he is because even when, no, when he was carrying no bar, he was like, is that as fast as you can go? Girl, come here. And then he just started like light speed through the thing. She couldn't even keep up at that point. But what I really wanted to talk about was Shining Moment was no bar. Because they both got hit by the poison. And she was smart enough to use her resonance technique. And honestly, there's been, I'm sure y'all have seen it on the internet. There's been a lot of memes comparing like Nobara to Sakura. And this is going to put those to a rest. Because she had a moment. She was fighting a younger brother. And she was like, about hitting him with the nails. And then the dude, she turned around. She was about to start fighting another dude with Yuji. And the little brother like, got behind her. And she was like, oh, I didn't show you this one. Hairpin. And just, bow, just killed that dude. Killed him. And they both, they know they're human. So they both know that they killed humans. Um, part that touched my heart was the, the, the bigger brother started crying. And, and even Yuji was like, hey, dad, man, I'm sorry about this. Black Flash! I think I already said that, but just in case, I had to reiterate that. I had to run it back in case I said it before. Actually, my second time shooting this video, the first time I messed up big time. So I don't know what I said anymore. But yeah, hit that man with the meanest Black Flash, and he was in that zone. I, man, I love it when animes introduce the zone. Kuroko's basketball did it best with the with the whole zone thing, but this that black flash zone, that's a whole nother beast. The fact that once you get in there, you can just like spew black flashes like it's nothing. Come on, man. Come on, that's real. And then the walk back when UG was talking to Nobara was like, is this your first time killing a person? I like the way Nobara really broke it down to him. I think that was the best thing she could do and that was the best way she could say it. I have a limited, she said I have a limited amount of people that I can protect and save. Though all those seats are full. I can only protect those people. Everybody else, sorry, not sorry. And then she was like, occasionally somebody like you will come up, bring your own seat and sit down. So by default, now I got to look out for you. You weren't in the plans, but you just showed up and made room for yourself. And that's honestly the way he has to look at it. It's, it's a doggy dog world out there. Curses are out there. You've got humans working with the curses. You can't save all the humans. You got to take, you got to let some of them take the L. Not the innocent humans, but I'm talking about the evil ones. They're clearly out to, to do more harm to humanity than good. So, yeah, you got to take the L. And Yuji admitted he'd done it before. Nobar didn't say she did it before. So, she's cool with it because that was in her expectations. But I don't think she's ever done it. And she was less shaken up than Yuji was. So, that was, that was a little bit of strange part. But at the end, they're all three together. It was like a, a little, little bonding scene. I see why they called it, um... 
Wasn't that what I saw? The alliances? I think it was a lot. Allegiance? Yeah, Allegiance. I see why I was called that. But yeah, overall, Jujutsu Kaisen, one of the best animes that came out this season or this quarter of animes, whatever you want to call it. Honestly, 2020. One of the best animes of 2020. And 2020 ain't really have a lot of good in it. So that, that's saying a lot. Jujutsu Kaisen was a shining star. It did, yeah, yeah, because it had about 24 episodes. Yeah, yeah. But um, anyways, what did y'all think of the season finale? Jujutsu Kaisen had a lot of action. Um, It ended with Gojo telling them to come back. I got a special mission for y'all. So whenever it comes back, it's going to pick right back up into the action. Massive plot development. Nobara didn't get as much of a power up as Megumi and Yuji did, but it's still good. That she had her moment. Every character had their moment. And they're about to be promoted to first grade sorcerers. Going to be lit next season. What did y'all think? Comment down below. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Do all the social media jazz. Uh, my videos, just like these first years are going to be next season. We we first grade. We first rate over here. First rate, first grade, special grade sorcerer and video editing skills. And make sure you subscribe. Uncrowned Otaku, I'm out of here.